momentous occasion as I would like us to celebrate. And that is the up and coming birthday of my grandson, Vincent Bashman Livingston. Well, the play has been uh, something that's been kind of expanding in my head for the last four, four or five years. Uh, and then uh, I received the Standard Bank Young Artist Award and they commissioned a piece. And so I drew on the nearest project I had been developing that was kind of ready to go. Oh, he's a jolly good fellow. Boy, he's a jolly good fellow. Boy, he's a jolly good It's basically uh, follows 150 years in the life of three South African families and how. Uh, you know, Zulu Afrikaans and uh, English family and just how their histories are all intertwined and, and mashed up and it, it kind of follows two young lovers in the present and how they kind of begin this uh, excavation of their own past and starting to understand how historic events have really linked them in ways that they hadn't expected. <laughs> I think it's kind of romantic. Don't you? I mean, she's 17, he's 28. Yeah. Isn't that <laughs> I want to tell really uniquely South African stories that speak to us as South Africans in a fresh, original way that don't rely on cliché and stereotypes, but I want you to really feel like you're meeting real, full-blooded South African characters. And it's a challenge, but I think it's one worth, worth taking on. My father says you've been with three HIV tests in the last four months. I'd like to take precautions. You're not in a relationship, are you, Vincent? No. <laughs> and uh, when last did you have intercourse? You Sex? Not, 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 not for a while. And uh, how many sexual partners have you had over the last, say, five years? None that I can think of off the top of my head. <laughs> I think we've got to really encourage this fusion of, of the two the communities between Cape Town, Joburg, Durban, Bloemfontein. We've got to share our actors a lot more and I think I really like to work like that. I don't like to work with the same people over and over. I really like to encourage putting new energies and performers together and, and seeing what comes out of that sort of collaboration. Katrine, yeah. who's that guy that you meet on some of your lunch breaks at the bus stop? Oh, sis, man, have you been spying on us? Oh. Yes, you have. Are you like one of those stalker weirdos who chops up schoolgirls and then puts them in the freezer? I wasn't spying, Katrine. Uh, it would have been kind of cool if you were. <laughs> I really challenge people to get out there, PVR, whatever the show you're missing on TV, you cannot PVR live theatre. Um, it's also better than the cinema, there's this wonderful exchange between live performers and an audience. And to my mind, you cannot beat that experience. <laughs> Let's go, 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 let's go